Dinah Chan has won Singapore's first cycling gold medal in 16 years after being quickest in the women's 30km individual cycling time trial. The 27-year-old posted a time of 46 minutes and 30.125 seconds. After winning a gold medal, it felt like I had to carry the weight of Singapore cycling because you had to do equally as well or improve on your performance. That put a lot of pressure on myself and it started to eat at me. I started training even harder and I guess I didn't take care of my body properly and I started having strange pains in my legs that could not be diagnosed. It was a pain that I can't describe. It feels as though my legs are on fire. I basically can't cycle properly, I can't go hard, I can't go at the intensity which is needed for racing. Basically every day I had to force myself to get onto the bike or force myself to go to training. So by 2015 I was barely hanging on. When I got the bronze in 2015 it was very disappointing because almost uh, it was in Singapore on home ground and I was expected to get the gold. And I couldn't and I didn't, but at least I still got a medal. Honestly, I didn't know how to face my friends and family who were there. Like, I think a lot of them were there for the first time watching live. So it was very disappointing. I was already thinking of giving up and stopping this altogether because I could not find a solution out of this. But the Specs scholarship took me in and I became a Specs scholar because they believed that I could do much more than what I had achieved previously. I was losing my belief in myself but they were the ones that believed in me and I took it as a, a blessing from God and it's a sign that he wants me to continue cycling. With the funding from Specs scholarship, I was able to get a new coach who's based in Australia and she decided that we had to get to the root of the pain in my legs. It was actually just due to extreme dehydration. I wasn't having enough water and electrolytes. I also had a very fresh perspective of life. We have to have a balance in life. Your spiritual, your mental, your emotional. In the past, whenever I used to not finish training, I would be very, very hard on myself. And I learned that it's okay for you not to hit those numbers because as long as you've given your 100%, it's all that matters. You've given your best and that's good enough. I'm very excited to be a track cyclist now. Training is much more intense and very fast. It's like a fresh start because I've never done this event at SEA Games before. I guess I've found my love for cycling again. I have never been happier in my life. I have this piece that I can't describe. I hope to get a gold at the SEA Games this year. I give back to Singapore for their belief in me, even though I've never competed in this event before. With help from God, I don't feel that it's that hard anymore. As long as I give my best and my all, it's enough. I'm ready for KL. Come back me up.